Table tennis has experienced uh, tremendous growth over the last few years in Canada. We are slowly getting into the public eye as a serious sport. And we're back from Mississauga from my table tennis club, the ITTF North America Cup at the semifinal stage. The second semifinals in the women's singles, Judy Hugh from the USA against Canada's top player, Mo Tsang. Here the, the favorite of this match is definitely Mo Tsang. Mo was one of the best juniors in the world at 18. She finished at the quarterfinals and the world championships. Mo has been in Canada since she was 13 years old and moved to the National Training Center, uh, makes her base in Ottawa now, but spends much of her time outside of Canada. And there it is, 4-2, 11-7 in game number six. Mo Zhang beats Judy Yu of the United States to earn a place in the finals against Ariel Singh. Mo did the right thing. She had a fantastic attack. But nine all, three three. This game is going to be decided by two points. And Ariel Singh has got two serves. Oh, match point for Ariel Singh. <laughs> ten ten in the seventh game. Second match point for Ariel Singh. What drama here in Mississauga. Unbelievable table tennis. And Ariel Singh repeats her ITTF North America Cup win. She will go to the World Cup. And Mo Tang finished second. She did not play at the top of her game in the first three, uh, first four games, but uh, at the end she played well and Ariel played one better. With the first semi-finals of the men's singles and the fam finals is going to be between Timothy Wang of the United States and Pierre-Luc Thériault of Canada. Well, it's going to be a very exciting match. Uh, I think uh, I particularly like uh, Pierre-Luc Thériault's style. He moves a lot, he's got great serves, great attack. And uh, Timothy, he's uh, just a very solid player. He's got good backhand, good forehand, so there will be some very heated exchanges. That's right. already an aggressive backhand from uh, Pierre-Luc Thériault. I think he's uh, determined to, to go for everything that he, he's got. Uh, he will not hold back here. He was a little bit disappointed he did not qualify for the Olympics at the North American qualifier. He had uh, not a very good tournament and uh, Timothy Wong did qualify in singles. I think for the tournament I would like to win. I think it's possible but it's not going to be easy. I'm going to have to play well. And for the team I think if we could have two Canadians in final that would be pretty good. And there it is. 4-0, 11-7 in game four for Pierre-Luc Thériault. Booking his place in the finals of the ITTF North America, which means there will be one Canadian for sure in the final. That is Pierre-Luc Thériault. And uh, he must be one happy camper here. For the Olympic Games this year in London, we might be able to cause a surprise depending on our draw. But for 2016, we expect big things. We think that our younger players are going to mature and our top player will be in his best age at the time. He will be 31. To more the North America Cup, nothing uh, short of winning both events would be a disappointment for us. We are missing our best three players, unfortunately, one to injury and two of them to uh, eligibility. But I still think that a Canadian should win uh, tomorrow in the men's singles. We think that uh, on the men's side, uh, Andre is one of the favorites again. He just beat the whole American team at the Olympic qualifier. 
My name is Andre Ho and I've been playing on the national team since I was 14. Representing Canada for the Olympic Games is the biggest it can be for an athlete. I'm very excited and I'm, and I'm going to try to do everything I can to play as well as I can and prove that you know, I can do well in, in the world stage. And we're back with the second semi-finals. It pits Adam Hugh against Andre Ho. And Andre is the player of, of this year, really. He, uh, uh, he has been playing well, but not really well for a long time. Uh, wasn't able to get his world ranking up, and in the last four or five months, he's gone up to over 200 positions in world ranking with very few competitions, which is difficult to do. I think if you look at any successful athlete in the world, for sure mentally they're very strong and you know at any time they're thinking about what they can do to, to win and I think what drives me is that I want to be one of the best. What and a save! Andre wins that. What a fantastic finish to this. And we're back at the finals, the men's finals of the ITTF North America Cup. Andre Ho is already leading by a score of 9 to 5. And he's playing against his training partner and teammate Pierre-Luc Thériault. Oh, Amazing beautiful backhand. Beautiful backhand. Beautiful backhand. Match points Three match points for Pierre-Luc Thériault of Saint-Fabien-Québec. I think they will, they will, this uh, would mean probably the biggest uh, title that he's biggest won. Biggest so. title for sure. Biggest result ever for Pierre-Luc Thériault. And, and here he goes. He raises his fist. Well deserved. Well fought. Excellent play by Pierre-Luc Thériault. 